Rata Laika Games. I rata like that logo. I don't like that one too much. It's okay. It's it, it g- does what it needs to do. It's it, okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, mm-hmm. It's fine. Hello, save room. This week on Bergen Bin Lounge, it's save room, and just as like, as uh, you were just starting the software, I just got it. Yep. I just got it. Yep. It is. A game based off the inventory management system of the original Resident Evil 4 and, I guess, even the remake. So what this is, is a... room. (laughs) It is a collection of puzzles, and all you have to do is fit in all the inventory. That's it. I've solved all the puzzles, and this is all you get. Except number 40. Well, it... That's the one I was on. Oh, oh, that's the... Oh, I, I now, guess. don't worry. All of these were 100% completed. So I'm going to let you choose which puzzles you want to play, because I've already solved all these. Well, let's go ahead and start at the beginning, then. But I I, I just got it. Like, the, like, it's been a week since you told me it was going to be Save Room. Like, oh, Save Room. That's that inventory puzzle management game. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is it called Save Room? Why is it called Save... Oh. That's why it's called Save Room. Yep, they can't ca- call it Resident Evil 4 inventory puzzles. Because you're trying to save room. There you go. You finished it. Yay. So that's the premise. Fit everything in there and solve the puzzles. And some of these are actually very devious. I love it. All right. Well, this one is pretty obvious. That can only fit right there. And this. Yeah, start you off small. Can only fit there in this egg. Hmm. Egg. Hmm. No. I think if you actually place it on top of something, it'll actually pick it up. Yeah, there you go. No. That has actually helped me solve a few puzzles, honestly. Hmm. I'm going to have to restart this Hold one. on. Do I need to douse the open area with Dang. yellow paint for you to get it? Let me try this again. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. This one can only go right here. Correct. Okay. All right. I see you've been enjoying the yellow paint discourse as well. It was stupid then. It's stupid now. Ta-da! Well, like on the one hand, yeah, that 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 screenshot of the cliffs being getting uh, sprayed with yellow paint, a little overkill, just just a little. Who cares? Like like it's not that big of a deal, really. No, it's not. It's it's just just a little tiny baby bit overkill, but it doesn't ruin the game for me. It's fine. All right, good luck with this one. Oh, shit. This is a fun one. Oh wait, so they probably want me to do that. There you go! Look at you being the puzzle guy! Yeah, I got it. So, uh, let me tell you a fun little story regarding this game. Uh, I hurt my back earlier last year. (laughs) I know, hysterical. But, uh, I played this and a uh, Hatsune Miku game for about an entire week. So just imagine me just, like, trying to find a comfortable position on a bed that probably caused the issue. And just going, I think I'll just solve some puzzles, because I don't want to do anything else. Can so, like, if I, anything, I this helped me just... through an extremely painful moment of 2023. That was just when the year got started, too. Alright, well, I'm going to need to put these on the field at some point. Yeah, so what this game will end up doing is they'll start introducing new guns. Uh, they'll also start introducing health where you have to use some of the healing items, but only the correct ones, because you still have to fit everything else into the box. Uh Uh-huh. So it's cool. I like it. Let's go up here. Is it worth the $5 I spent for it? You know what? Kinda, yeah. You know, for the the concept, you know. You get 40 puzzles. That's an afternoon. It's not too bad. Cheap thrill. I mean, if if, if you paid 20 for this, I would have have balked a bit. Oh, Lord, no. Oh, yeah. Like, even if this was a $10 game, I would still just, like, use my Nintendo coins. Ain't no way I'm spending this much. Oh, there you there go. There we go. You win. That's it. That's the stuff right fucking there. I was also in a real big puzzle game uh, kick at that time. You know, I had nothing better to do. So I bought this and... You had to, you had to go into your backlog? <laughs> Thankfully, I was able to clear it. Around the time I got some kick-ass medicine. Do you know what the medication prednisone is? I bet you're going to tell me. Only if you want to. I bet I'm going to hear it anyway. 
Just, just, just tell me, man. It's a story. Come on. I'm just, I'm just putting boxes and things. Consider it a uh, muscle reset button. <laughs> oh. Basically, what it said is, "Hey, that uh, back muscle that's having a spasm. No, redo it." And uh, over the course, and it's actually a medication where you have to self wean yourself off of it. Oh my. The uh, medication directions give you very specific instructions on how much to take throughout the day, and you take so little of it by the last day, you wean yourself off of it. Very interesting. This one's gonna be a bit of a tough one. And oh. also, it f worked like a charm. So, um, that was a, that was a band camp guy, of course. Yeah. Ba band geek, right here. Tee hee. Uh, everyone knows what band camp is, right? Yeah. It's essentially where you spend a week you, you, you oh, go. You put go a, to put all your boxes in between the uh, rifle and the shotgun. I'm trying. I was gonna see if I can move this though. Uh, okay. See if that would clear up some space. Oh. I still got two guns to fit here. The the SMG is the hardest to fit in. I would say find a place for that and then work around that. They're awkwardly shaped. Yeah. Well, anyway, um, the way band camp worked for us is that we went to uh, a college at, uh, out of uh, county college, uh, college, I suppose. And we would bar their dorms and just stay there for a week and learned our show for the season. And so we learned, like, you know, the, the moves for, for all that, where we'd start learning the, uh, the music that we'd be, we'd be playing, start memorization for that, so that way when we come back and the school year begins, we'll be on a better foot. So, um... We were, of course, the Sousaphones. Go Team Sousa. Go Team Sousa, indeed. Uh, me... So all three of the Sousaphones roomed together. Of course, putting a Sousa, you know, you, you know, carrying a sousaphone around is certainly tough work. You're doing the marching and all that. You don't really get much rest. It was, it was, it was pretty exhausting. So uh, our, uh, what, uh, our, our, our friend there to deal with the shoulder pain that we would certainly have had some ointment to give us oh. to help out the pain. Uh huh. You know the uh, animal feed store over on over on the street, you know, d down here. Yeah, that's that, that's that's his that's his folks' shop. Okay, how good's this ointment? He gave us horse tranquilizer. <laughs> Are you okay? It worked. I mean, that's yeah, it worked. Now this one's deceptively deceptively hard, but it's that's easy. That's that's fine. No problem. Now, uh, are you allowed to? Oh yeah, you need to re reloading. Oh. So it needs to be a uh, fully reloaded uh, gun box. So you could just put them on, put the ammo on top of the gun; it'll reload it. Yeah. SMG bullets. There you go. I see. There you go. You thought you were using twenty-five handgun bullets and only twelve SMG bullets. Now we got a wee woad. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, this big rifle is gonna take up some, a lot of, many, much space. That's a sentence. Yep. It can really only fit in one area. I will say you can also combine ammo boxes if need be. I think. That might be the way to go. Do that. That's riff ammo. Yep. There you go. So that's as is. Yeah, you got the smig. This this silly looking thing. Silly fitting thing. Yeah, Ada sees that. She's, she's gonna go. Mm -hmm. No. He get the job done with that, really? A uh, Ada, please. How are we gonna do this? Now let's take some of the mup ammo. Okay. Can I tell you one thing I learned today? What? I was just browsing around YouTube, and all of a sudden, a short came up. And it wasn't it wasn't clickbait or anything like that. It was like I bet you didn't know this, and I was like I probably do know it, but I'll I'll humor you. What you got, man? Uh, I never even considered throwing eggs at nice people. In Resi Four. In Resi Four Remake, if you throw an egg at Ashley, she goes, "What the?" <laughs> but even better, if you throw an egg at the merchant, he looks like he wants to fight you. <laughs> 
You turn it because it's it's of poor service. Oh, it was my fault then. Well, egg on my face, stranger. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's sh shotgun ammo. Shotgun ammo. Yeah, shotgun. That is that is a shotgun. That is a shotgun. It looked like the riffle. Well, it's eh, a little bit. Riffle's longer. Riffle is longer. All right, where is this beast gonna go? We'll try right there for now. This should be a fairly up, up, simple up, puzzle, up, up, but up. I think this is the one where they introduce combining ammo, just in case you run out of space. Uh. Oh, uh, you can fit it right there. Yeah, put it right there. Oh, crap. That works. Hey, it works! Oh! Right, cool. Oh! Oh! Well, that just opened this thing wide oh, open! Oh! Almost, at Almost. least. Okay. Actually, no, you can we, still make that. We, we gotta combine you, the shotgun. You, yeah, you can still make that. There we go. We got it, we got it. Because now if you it. move the handgun ammo up, ro rotate that one. Oh, uh, shit. Well, oh, uh, issue. Put, issue. Put the gun, the handgun, connected to the shotgun down there at the barrel. So, turn it around. Click, click. Uh, and then all the way down, as much as it can. All the way down? Keep going. Wait, we got it. Oh, yeah, there you go. Never mind. It might have worked either way. Somehow we were both wrong, but we got it both right. Yay! Teamwork! Teamwork! <laughs> <laughs> you really have beat this game! Yeah, rocket launcher now! Hell yeah! It's like my lucky brown egg. It heals half of your HP, it's great! That... that... Oh, yeah, so this uh, is what I ended up doing as well. Like, as soon as I see multiple boxes, I see what needs reloading, do that first. And then I see, oh, what can I combine? Okay, do that. Rocket launcher is a weird shape. Nah. I really wish I could just put stuff outside the lines there, or have, like, you know, analog control. Well, then you would throw it away. And we don't want that. I don't, I mean, you can't throw it away. I would, that would create a fail state that you wouldn't. You in the original can't. Resident Evil 4, that's how you throw stuff away. Well, this isn't the original Resident Evil 4. It's but not, it's, it's based it's, off it's, of it's it. Not, it's not even it's the real Resident Evil 4. You could probably fit that rocket launcher in the crevice. Right there. Schlink. Followed by another schlink. And you know what? I think we got an extra special schlink right here. Cool. Where Where's the shotgun going? Fucking shotgun. Yeah. <laughs> uh, try fitting the rocket launcher in that crevice of two. In this right here, right oh, there. Oh, that'll help you so much. Oh, yeah, okay. I love puzzles. <laughs> now, now th this is a good one. Ooh, almost. Oh, uh, the handgun probably needs need. readjusting. We can probably can fit it right there. Actually, yeah. So all we got to uh, move the ammo. Yeah, that's all we got to do. We got to move this buckshot huh. down over here, and we got it. It's almost got it. Almost. 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 Uh, there we go. Almost. Fuck. That handgun's got to move. Yeah. All right. Okay. Let's see. There. For that. Shit. Uh, move the, move the egg. Let's get the egg out of here. I mean, I mean, we can we can get these three together. We can we can make magic happen. So there's that. Move the. Not hmm. quite. Oh, uh... Hey, all right. Oh, there we go. Winner. I may have brought this up, but, uh... Have I ever told you about a game called Cathedral? I don't remember you ever bringing up this game as a puzzle game. It is an actual board game. Oh, uh, then no, I, I don't remember talking about it. So it's a game where you got, like, this, uh... This board. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're explaining there you it. Go. It's, a, it's a grid of, I'd say, what... 12 by 12, I think. Mm -hmm. 12 by 12 squares. Maybe 16 by 16. But you also have these uh, specific buildings. One's white, one's red. And some of them are awkward, some of them are large and awkwardly shaped. Some of them are small, and they just got all these different shapes. And uh, the, you know, one's one's like a bridge. One's like an inn. One's like a you know like a like a castle of sorts. All these different buildings. Mm -hmm. And there's a big white building in the center, which is the cathedral, and that's where you build your your pieces around there. Okay. So you you uh, it kind of works like this. You kind of move uh, uh, place buildings around, creating territories, and then with the territory that you have, you kind of just uh, 
place the buildings down. And by the end, you have an, an actually authentic looking French city. Ooh! So then you take the board up, and you hold it at eye level, and it's got like this, it's, 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 it's magnificent. Hmm. Absolutely magnificent city building board game. That sounds fun, actually. It, it, oh, it is. Okay, good. It's, 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 it's easy to learn, just, just, just simple, simple connecting. It's just lovely. Connect the dots. Create the buildings. Build Rome in a day, or maybe the city of Versailles? I don't know. Versailles good. I like Versailles. I've been there once. Why didn't I think about screen wrap? That makes too much sense. After you're, you've are you been playing this for like, hour, actual hours on end, you, you start to go stir crazy when you're not using screen wrap. Oh, I'm dying. You are dying. How do you use it? There we go. Uh, press X, <laughs> and it comes up with its own uh, <laughs> indiv <Okay>. individual uh, <laughs> use here. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, this, this game's charming. I like it. I mean, I'm. I see about all there is going to see. I'm probably not going to get it, but. Oh yeah, it's we're, we're already uh, more than one fourth of the way done with the entire game. So yeah, it goes by quick. If you need like, like two hours worth of of puzzles, there you go. If you love Resi Four and unpacking is still too much money. <laughs> Go with save room. Ah, uh, shoot. You did it. Yeah, I did. Yeah, we gotta get that uh, thing fitting somehow. There we go. Got it. Ta da! There we go. These are my favorite kinds of puzzles. The kind that we, the kind where you just go, hmm. Oh! Mm, oh! There it is. Got it. Yeah! And I like that you can still have open space in your, uh, in your inventory. That's very nice. There we go. What do you think? Save room two? Mm, I don't know. How, like, how much more could they add to this paradigm? Because, uh, l l let me actually show you the final level. Oh, okay. And I'll have you do this one. Oh, oh okay. I mean, it, it's just like all the other puzzles. It's not like it's near impossible, but uh, now shoot the zombie! <laughs> Kill the enemy! You could, you could, you know, put time limits on there. Time trial mode. There Perhaps. you go. Figure out that shit. Oh goodness. Okay. Well, need to get these fit on here somehow. That rifle is impossible. <laughs> it's so stupid looking. Okay. I got them all fit on here. I imagine we can combine these herbs, right? You'd be right. Okay. That and green. But since this is going by the logic of Resident Evil 4, it has to be green, red, yellow. Can I combine these or are these? Full, I believe. Full I'm trying to remember what those are. Uh, for science, try combining them with something. Nope. They combine with themselves. Oh! They're gunpowders. Okay. Okay. Yep. Now it's coming back. And one by itself. Hey, that's okay. Still gets the job done. Click. Click. Clark. Whoop. Okay. Now I know it, it's already a failure, unfortunately. What? Uh, you needed magnum ammo. Magnum ammo? Yep. What's magnum ammo? So go ahead and reset. Uh, uh, open item menu. Or I hit options. Wow, so many options. So many options. Whoa. Maybe it's the Y button to auto reset. Oh, it just reset anyway. I'll do that then. Okay. All right. So. Or about the big restart in the upper left there. Oh How's that yeah. Oh, let's 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 try it out. Wow. Look at that transition. Okay. All right. So for gunpowders, try uh blue with a green. Blue with the green. There's rifle. Uh, red with the green. Red with the green. There's your magnum bullets, I believe. Is that this? No. Nope. No. Is that uh, this? No. Red with a red should it's be a uh, handgun. It was magnum. Okay. So there's your rifle. What are these? That's that's rifle. That's rifle. So it would be this. 
Correct. Okay. All right. And then uh, red with a red should be handgun. Green with a green is shotgun. And blue with a blue is SMG. Green. Green. Click. Blue. Blue. Cool. All right. We're in there. Click. And now for the funny part. Go ahead and make all those full heals. Yeah. Now eat a rotten egg. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> You're on fine. Yes! You're on fine. <laughs> oh, lovely. Uh, uh, X. Uh, item there use. You Okay, Ooh. you're on orange caution. So before you kill yourself, use a full heal. Oh, that that that, that would kill me. Yes. And now eat it again. Eat another. <laughs> Ow. There we go. Yeah, it's clearing space. I feel fine. Uh, uh, <laughs> tentatively fine. Huh. Mm. All, All right. right. Now the now you've cleared out tons of space. Now it's just fitting those guns. All right, let's fit the guns in here. All the guns. Yeah, that's that's a nice fit. That's a nice click. Yeah, it also has some satisfying, like, you when you piece them together, it's just like, oh, yes, that'll work. I think Wheatley uh, in Portal 2 has the best reaction to uh, solving a puzzle. Oh, 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 that's it. That's it. <laughs> Ooh, found a place yeah. for your SMG, wait, I think. Wait, 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 uh, wait, bottom wait. left. No. No. Cock. Crap. <laughs> All right. Still got two guns left to left to do here. Mm -hmm. There is a guns. SMG's the hardest part. Ooh, the, close. No. What? Uh, ah. Ah. Try. Try flipping your shotgun, and take the magnum out real quick, just so we have a better view of everything. All right. So I would find a place for your handgun. And then go from there. All right, because the magnum has a longer barrel, so you can do more with that. In fact, in fact, oh, I got almost. It. Oh, Act, oh, no, oh, that wait. won't work. No, it won't work. Ah, yeah. All right, maybe we just need to flip it then. Uh, put it in the corner. Uh, handle towards the top left. Either the handgun or the magnum. Yeah, because you can still fit your egg somewhere in there. Oh, uh, almost. Eh. Eh. Oh. Just fit you, bastard. Told you it's that rifle, man. Uh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, wait, wait, hang on. That'll yeah, fit it. Yeah, yeah. Ugh! Nearly. Oog! Uh, mm, can I try something? Go ahead. I mean, you beat this, so this is your this is your wheelhouse, man. Uh, let's see. Um. What he's thinking. I'm gonna remove you for a second. It's moving like a Rubik's Cube. Never solved a Rubik's Cube myself. Haha. <laughs> I, on the other hand, also haven't. Nice. On the same wavelength of Rubik's Cube knowledge. I just wanted to bust into song. I hope you don't mind. Oh, by all, by all means. I'm not gonna fault you for wanting to burst into song, man. Could never, ever do that. Thanks. Live your best life. Oh, well. Still that magnum it's too issue. too disjointed, though. It is. But if I remember correctly, that's essentially how it... How the solution went. Oh, so close. Where's the auto sort button? Well, that would just that would just win the game for you. Yeah. You already, <laughs> What's your point? You already solved the level, so. Damn. Hmm. 
No. no, you made it worse. No. You're putting away too many guns. Get the hell out of here, you darn hunting rifle. But that has to be where they go, because it just, just just fits so nicely. How could it be anything else? Alright. So, one, two. So, four twos. Got four twos and a one. There's three twos and a one. Rotate the, uh, the pistol again. I wonder if someone in the comments has uh, figured out the uh, the solution already and is screaming at us right now. Got it. You got it? Yep, that's it. Yeah! You've been heard. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the help, guys. <laughs> Much appreciated. Oh, wow. That's, that, man, that fits perfectly. Good job. Wow. <laughs> ah, I love puzzles like this. Brilliant. There we go. We beat Save Room. Yay! Entire game. One video. That's all, stranger. <laughs> Thanks for playing. No problem. By the way, you're not getting any medals from this one. Get back to the real game now. Okay. Actually, yeah, okay. Skill issue, stranger. <laughs> I, I so think the merchant wants to say that at least once or twice, especially if you're playing on console and you can't shoot the damn medals. Oh, the shooting gallery's so hard oh. in 4 Remake. Oh, sounds like a skill issue, mate. <laughs> and then you hear Ashley from the back, SKILL ISSUE! Ah, uh, you poor lamb. It appears to be a skill issue. It seems you have a bit of a skill issue, Mr. Kennedy. Ay caramba, it's a skill issue. I like, I like new Luis better. <laughs> And then, of course, Wesker, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> so next time on Bargain Bin Lounge, I actually don't know what's coming up next. Yep, because it's on my, it's in my court now. It's your turn. Yes, it is. All right, so see you next time.